So with community-based nursing, Hey, good morning everyone. Today it is Tuesday. It is February February 19th right now. I've just been doing some work and listening to like Kathy Parks. If you don't know who Kathy Parks is, she really helps to prepare for ATI. And my ATI is week week 8, but because oh, that's my speaker. But it's week 8 and I have two proctored exams, one for leadership and one for um public health so I'm just been preparing for that but yeah I'm headed to the gym right now I'm already ready I've been ready since like nine but yeah but anyway if you're new here my name is Jasmine I'm 21 I am in a nursing program I'm in my public health rotation right now I never really explained in my videos I'm actually like really tired I'm not gonna go too hard today especially because I have work but I think this today's just gonna be kind of getting ready for a work kind of day and getting ready for night shift because I haven't done one of those in a long time. Not much really going on this week other than just my exam and then next week is going to be a really crazy week so I'll try to film that but I'm not sure how much I'll actually film. I was trying to make a to-do list but this is all I got so far because I've just been doing a lot of homework. Also I got this new sticker from a hydro flask. They gave it away during um they gave it away at the end of Crush. What I've noticed is Insomniac usually gives the upcoming rave sticker to give you like FOMO. So that one's for Beyond, but I'm not even going to Beyond probably just because I didn't buy a ticket and it's way expensive now. And then, I don't know, I just want to take a break. I went to Crush already, so I'm probably going to wait until like hard summer. <laughs> um, but we'll see. But I woke up kind of early today, and I slept at like 1.32ish last night, so I didn't get like a lot of sleep. So hopefully I can sleep a decent amount tonight. <sighs> because if I don't nap, then I'm like really, really struggling around like 4am. I work at 7pm to 7.30am, but 4am hits and I get really, really tired. Also, I didn't explain like, I'll probably talk about it on my way to the gym, but I really need to head out now. It's really bright and sunny today, what the heck? It's been raining so much in California, so this is actually really surprising. I was floated onto the med surge floor and I was doing a one-to-one -one and it was actually like really sad. She was danger to self, so yeah, so I don't want to say, I don't want to say too much, but basically that's what happened and then um she was a really really sweet lady and like i had like a really long conversation with her such an interesting experience the only issues that she was having was like she wasn't able to um go to the restroom by herself i don't usually do one-to-ones i usually am on the floor um, honestly i really like nights a lot more than days just because i have my whole day to study and then i'll nap and then i'll go to work and it doesn't mess with my schedule too too much for the most part and I'm just kind of like a nocturnal person, so it's fine with me. Okay, so I'm back. Whew. It was a pretty cardio heavy workout. I didn't work out like too, too hard. Probably less than an hour, honestly. But I'm headed home now. I wanted to talk a little bit about like raving and like the raving community. But I'm really hungry and thirsty and I really want to make a smoothie so I'm gonna come back to my point after I eat. 
these berries. I put some spinach already. And then I have banana. I don't know if I'm going to use this whole thing. And then some orange juice. And I'm going to put some ice. Okay, y'all, I guess this is my little mukbang corner because I always seem to be sitting here when I'm eating and talking to you guys. Move this up a little bit. So, I have, I don't even think you can see it, but I have my little bowl of spaghetti and then my smoothie that I made. Very citrusy, which is good because I need some vitamin C so I don't get sick. But I changed my shirt because... One, I spilled something on my on my top, so I need to cover that up. And then also, I just thought it was fitting because I decided that I'm going to talk a little bit about raving and just like the rave community because a lot of people have kind of a hard time understanding it. From the outside looking in, it will look kind of like odd and weird. Not explain it, but more so give an opinion on it. Hold on, I want to get crackers. I love like raving so much is just because a lot of time in a lot of times in nursing school, it's easy to focus on like the negative and even like be surrounded by negative people who are constantly seeing the negative in their life. But when I'm like around like my rave family or like around like the rave community, if you've heard of like the the saying plur like peace, love, unity, respect. It's like kind of promoting more like positive vibes. A way for me to kind of like cleanse from all the negativity and just yeah, like be around people who are positive and who really are accepting of who you are no matter what your race, what your, what your, what is it called, gender or anything like that. So that's why I really love it. And I know that sometimes it's hard to understand like why do we wear like those like crazy outfits? And it's to promote the fact that you are embracing being you and for me especially when I was like younger I would always wear like a lot of like black or some like fishnet and people would think that that was kind of like off the fact that you can embrace that in that community was just really like uplifting to me it's just like really freeing being that type of community where it's all positive vibes it's never like you can't like sit with us or whatever okay I don't really know the backstory because I'm still kind of new but shuffling I remember way, way back, and like when I was in eighth grade, it was a thing, and I kind of like heard of it. And I remember people would like SpongeBob and stuff like that, but I wasn't very good at it. <laughs> I wanted to learn it, but I never could. But that's kind of why I wanted to learn it now, and I kind of like caught on to it a little bit, but. That's why I love it so much. It's just like, it's just a really freeing community, and I'm just like really happy to be a part of something that's so accepting and loving, and, and it's just like this whole cycle. So yeah, I just wanted to like share my opinion on it. It's an opinion. It's not like um, giving any like really hard facts, but I feel like a lot of people didn't get it or don't get it, and I didn't really understand it when I first started, at, but. Don't knock it till you try it. For some reason, okay, I only body wash because I'm going to take a shower the next morning after I work. But, oh my gosh, that was so close to my face. But I only take 1.5 milligrams because it, melatonin has a real effect on me. Like, it works really well, sometimes too well. I took one, I don't know, the other day and I slept at 9 and I didn't even wake up until like 11.30. Okay, so right now it's like one. I'm going to take one of these melatonin. It only has, I think, well, one of these has 1.5 milligrams. So I'm just going to take one. If you're wondering where these are from, they're from Costco. The Vita Fusion. Sponsor me. So I went to sleep around like maybe 2, 
Yeah, probably around 2.30. I just woke up now, it's like 4.30. I'm gonna go ahead to- I like to go to Starbucks before my shift because I need a caffeine boost. But I usually look wrecked because of the fact- really like in my PJs. <laughs> Mango dragon fruit. Of course, anything else? That's all. Thank you, 445. Thank you. Can you tell I just woke up from my nap? Oh my god, I look so bad. Literally, it's not even that cold. I'm just dramatic and I'm wearing this jacket. Hey, fatty. I'm cooking mozzarella sticks. I have my. Starbucks, and then I'm gonna make some, not make some, warm up some soup. I'm so tired. I honestly feel like this is like an eat with me vlog. That's literally all I do is eat and sleep. Okay, so I know, look how much ice is in this. That's insane. I should have asked for light ice. It's literally my own fault. Right now it's about 5, so I have, oh no, it's 5.30. Oh my god. Yeah, so it's 5.30 right now. I'm probably gonna work for maybe an hour and then start getting ready. I live like really close to my work, so it's not that big of a deal. Um, but yeah. So my goal for today is to study chapter nine and 10. Sometimes I'll bring my homework with me and I'll just read through like the slides. So I have nine, 10 that I'll do, I'll do here. And then I'll do 12 and 13 when I'm there. Fun, fun, fun. Also, I printed out my slides differently this time just so that I could see like my professor's notes. I've noticed that a lot of these notes are actually the ones that are pertaining to the questions that she asks. So I wanted to print it out like that. It's just really lame. It doesn't print like front and back. So it was kind of a lot of paper, but sorry, I'll recycle next time. <laughs> Okay, y'all want to see some behind the scenes? I'll show you how I take my thumbnails. <laughs> so, I'm gonna put on half of it. This isn't what I actually wear to work. I just, I'm trying to take a thumbnail before I forget to take a thumbnail. I look so trash right now. Okay, so sometimes when my eyes start hurting from looking at the screen too much, I wear these, like, I think they're called, like, blue light something glasses. They're not even mine. They're literally my brother's, but <clears throat> sometimes my head starts hurting if I stare at the screen for too long. Okay, I just put on my uniform. I'm trying to look for my jacket. I can't even find it. I have to find a freaking jacket. So, I don't even think I ever explained, but at my work, they don't really care what kind of scrubs or what color you wear, or like even what jackets you wear. So, I just need to find something. Okay, I think this jacket will work. I usually like having one to the hood because sometimes when it's like 4 a.m. and it's like freezing, I like to put my hood on, but this will work. <sighs> Pretty sure I got this from Old Navy like maybe on Black Friday like two years ago. I never really use it that much, but it's kind of thin, that's why. <laughs> Okay, everyone, I'm off to work now. I'm driving. <sighs> I'll see you guys in the morning. Hey, what's up, everyone? It's morning. It's about 7.30 right now. I'm driving home. I'm finally off my 12-hour shift, and I'm done for my shifts for the week. Um, I am so tired, and all I want to do is take a shower and go to bed. Um, but yeah... I need to do a little bit more studying today, but I'm just happy to be done with my shift because I'm so tired. But thank you guys for watching. Don't forget to check out my other vlogs. I've been posting pretty consistently, so you should go check those out. 
And then also I'm gonna leave my social media down below to post more on my social media. But yeah, I'll see you guys in the next vlog.